Also raised here in the state of Montebello, California, last round boxing gym, catching up with undefeated super bantamweight weight uh, boxer Pablito Jr. Uh, Pablito Ruby Jr. Pablito, you got a fight uh, coming up scheduled on April 6th at the Belasco Theater. How have you been? Uh, I've been great. We've been training hard. Uh, you know, we've been getting some solid rounds in for, for all the sparring. And, you know, we've been getting ready. We, we had some time off, but uh, we're ready to get back into it. April 6th, uh, ready to make the same and back in there and uh, ready to give a show again. Since your last fight, uh, a decision over David Perez back in July of uh, 2017. It's been a little bit over six months. Why is it that you took uh, a little break this, this layoff? Uh, I had a small hand injury. Um, we wanted to make sure that it was good, so we gave it some time off. Uh, but other than that, we've still been training hard and uh, haven't been hitting the bag, but uh, we got back into that. So, you know, we're good again and uh, we're ready to start hitting everybody right now. <laughs> Are you anxious to get back in the ring, trying to exchange Almost some uh, punches with your anxious. opponent? Yeah, um, just the fact that we couldn't hit anything for, for some time was, it was just like, I was just anxious to, to start hitting something. So the, the fact that we're back on on uh, uh, April 6th, feel great feel ready so I'm pretty sure you weren't doing any sparring but you were at the gym you were uh, still in shape um, you're going back to the venue where you've had most of your fights how does it feel to going to be going back to the Belasco where you pretty much will be drawing a big crowd on the April the 6th uh, it's, it's gonna feel great um, you know it's it's home it's home uh, you know that's where that's where I'm from that's where everybody's at uh, that's where the spark of the, the excitement comes from, you know, uh, from all the fans, Shark Sports. Uh, and we're ready to give a show and let, it, let that excitement begin. Can you say, now that you're rubbing your hands, uh, Pablito, can you say your hands are 100% healed for your upcoming bout? Uh, I believe so, you know, ready to go. <laughs> <laughs> Andres Valdera is your opponent for April 6th, a record of five wins, three losses. You're an undefeated fighter. Uh, 10 and 0 with uh, three chaos. Talk to us about your upcoming fight against Andres Balderas. Uh, you know, we don't know much about him. Um, there wasn't really anything on him um, other than, you know, his record five wins with four knockouts. So we're going to think that he's going to come in with power. Um, three losses, but it uh, seems like a, he's probably going to be a powerful, powerful fighter. Um, he is a lefty, fights Southpaw. And uh, so, so you've been preparing for this mm -hmm. fight against Southpaw. Uh, exactly. Um, I can't remember the last partners. name, but uh, this is uh, one guy that we've been sparring. Uh, he's a straight lefty. His name, his first name's Aron, and uh, I believe he fights this weekend in Mexico or in Cancun, I think. Okay. And uh, he's about like a 20 and 0, 22 and 0. Uh, great fighter, and he gave me some rounds. So you know, I appreciate it with him and. Uh, you know, we're, we're gonna put on a great show. I don't think we're gonna have any problems with the lefty. So your partner, your uh, your teammate, John Leon, is back from Colombia. You guys are turning together. You guys make a great team. Are you happy to have him back in town? Almost definitely, you know, uh, we support each other. We push each other and it's, it's gonna be great. You know, we're, we're both gonna come back strong and uh, we're Shark Sports is gonna make a statement. No injuries, uh, putting injuries aside, uh, Pablito. How many times will you be planning on fighting uh, this year for the year 2018? Whew, I want to get this back on the road, you know, because um, we stopped about almost halfway of 2017 and uh, I want to get back to it in 2018. So, you know, as, as much as I can, really, as much as I can, you know, we're, we're going to hope between four, four to six fights. I'm hoping four to six fights at least. I know I've asked you this before, but is there any any signs that you'll be signing with our promoters? Mm, or will you be leaving may, that? Maybe a couple more fights. A couple more fights. A couple more fights and we'll be there. We'll <laughs> be there soon. Is your fight going to be part of the telecast on April 6th? I believe so, actually. I think I'm going to be opening. Uh, that's what the it telecast? seems like. Yeah. Oh, that's great. Yeah. On uh, Estrella, uh, no, Estrella, Estrella TV. TV? Yeah. Okay. There you have it, ladies and gentlemen. Thank you for your time against Pablito. Thank Pablito you. Rubio versus Andres Valderas. April 6th at the Velasco Theater in downtown LA. Thank you, Pablo. Thank you.